In question four, we have to find the value of each of the following division expressions involving rational numbers. To do this problem, we will make use of the fact that rational numbers can be divided just like how we divide fractions. So, to divide one rational number by another, we can multiply the first rational number, which is the dividend, with the reciprocal of the second rational number, which is the divisor. Okay, so let's start with the first part in which we have to calculate minus 4 divided by 2 by 3. So we can write this as minus 4 into the reciprocal of 2 by 3 is 3 by 2. So we have to simply multiply minus 4 and 3 by 2. Now min minus 4 you can think of this as minus 4 by 1. So this product will be you multi multiply the numerators minus 4 into 3 and the denominators 1 into 2 so minus 4 by 3 is minus 12, minus 4 into 3 is minus 12 and 1 into 2 is 2. So you get minus 12 by 2. Then you divide by 2 above and below. So you get minus 6 by 1, which we can write as minus 6. So in the first part, the value of the expression is minus 6. Okay, now in part 2, we have to calculate minus 3 by 5 divided by 2. So you can think of 2 as the rational number 2 by 1. Okay, so we can write this as minus 3 by 5 into the reciprocal of 2 by 1 is 1 by 2. And now we multiply the numerators. So we get minus 3 into 1 over the product of denominators is 5 into 2. And this gives us minus 3 over 10. So in part 2, the value of the expression is minus 3 by 10. Then we come to part 3 in which we have to calculate minus 4 by 5 divided by minus 3. You can think of minus 3 as minus 3 by 1. And now you can write this as minus 4 by 5 into the reciprocal of minus 3, which uh, the reciprocal of minus 3 by 1, which will be 1 over minus 3. So now we multiply the uh, numerators. Uh, which is minus 4 into 1 and the denominators which uh, which will be minus 5 into minus 3 so minus 4 into 1 is minus 4 5 into minus 3 is minus 15 so we get minus 4 by minus 15 if we divide above and below by minus 1 we will get 4 by 15 so in part 3 the value of the expression is 4 by 15 okay then we come to part 4 in which we have to calculate minus 1 by 8 divided by 3 by 4. So we can write this as minus 1 by 8 into the reciprocal of 3 by 4 which is 4 by 3. So now we multiply the numerators and the denominators like this. So this will give us minus 4 over 8 into 3 is 24. Now HCF of 4 and 24 is 4. So if we divide above and below by 4, we get minus 1 in the numerator and 6 in the denominator. So we will get minus 1 by 6. So in part 4, the value of the expression is minus 1 by 6. Okay, next we come to part 5 in which we have to calculate minus 2 by 13 divided by 1 by 7. So we can write this as minus 2 by 13 into the reciprocal of 1 by 7, which will be 7 by 1. And now we multiply the numerators. So that gives us minus 2 into 7 and the denominators. So that gives us 13 into 1. So this gives us minus 14 in the numerator and 13 in the denominator. So in part 5, the value of the expression is minus 14 by 13. Then in part 6, we have to calculate minus 7 by 12 divided by minus 2 by 13. So we can write this as minus 7 by 12 into the reciprocal of minus 2 by 13, which will be 13 by minus 2. Okay, so we multiply the numerators, that's minus 7 into 13. And we multiply the denominators, that's 12 into minus 2. So minus 7 into 13 is minus 91. And in the denominator, we have 12 into minus 2, that's minus 24. So we have minus signs in both numerator and denominator. So if you multiply above and below by minus 1, we can write this as 91 by 24. 
So in part 6, the value of the expression is 91 by 24. And then finally we come to part 7 in which we have to calculate 3 by 13 divided by minus 4 by 65. So we can write this as 3 by 13 into the reciprocal of minus 4 by 65 which is 65 by minus 4. So let's multiply the numerators. So we have 3 into 65 and the denominators. So that's 13 into minus 4. And now we note that both in the numerator and denominator we have multiples of 13. We have 6, 65 here and we have 13 here. So if we divide above and below by 13, we will have 65 by 13 is 5, 13 by 13 is 1. So 3 into 5 is 15 and 1 into minus 4 is minus 4. So we will get 15 over minus 4 and we can write this in standard form as by making the denominator positive. So we can write this as minus 15 by 4. So in part 7, the value of the expression is minus 15 by 4. So with this, we have completed all the parts of question number 4. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.